Well, some exciting and good news coming up in Rio Rancho. They're just hours away from cutting the ribbon on the latest fire station there, and one the people there say was desperately needed. We sent News 13's David Romero out to give us an inside look at it. Station 7 has been a long time coming. It will help um, cover an area of the city that we haven't been able to cover for quite some time. The new $1 million plus facility located on the northeastern side of town will cover at least two major neighborhoods in Vista Hills and Corrales Heights, as well as eight different schools, not to mention cutting down on response times. It'll actually help with the call volume for Station 1, which is the city's busiest station. And early on, we're predicting that there'll be a, it'll cover approximately about 2,500 calls per year. There was some concern earlier this year that there wouldn't be enough firefighters to staff the building. Surplus money in the city budget changed that. We'll actually be able to open this station with the same number of personnel that you would find staffed at other fire stations in the, in the city. With all the amenities of home, it's all about comfort for the firefighters who will live here. It may look pretty empty for now, but all that space will be necessary once firefighters move in. It does have some more living facilities and, uh, and storage facilities that we didn't see at some of the other stations. A new home for those who put their lives on the line to protect your home. And so we never really had a station that would service the area towards the center, and this Station 7 will do exactly that. David Romero, KRQE News 13. Now, even though the ribbon cutting is going to be this morning, the firefighters are not actually going to officially start working there until the first week in November. It's because the company that's furnishing the building had some shipping issues. But the firefighters say, no big deal, it's okay, because that gives them some time to settle in.